Big news this week for students in the Green Bay Area Public School District. UW-Green Bay and GBAPS announced a new partnership. It is a direct college admissions initiative, which will allow graduating Green Bay High School seniors to forego the typical college application process and get direct admission to UWGB, beginning with graduates in 2024. It is the first of its kind in the state. And here to tell us more about how it works and how it came to be is Jennifer for Jones, Assistant Vice Chancellor for Enrollment Services. So this must have been in the works for a while. How did this come about? Oh gosh, it started um, with who we are as an institution. So UW-Green Bay is a regional comprehensive university. That means we are, we're dedicated to serving our region. So that's first. And then we've developed this wonderful relationship with Green Bay Area Public Schools. And we have career coaches embedded in the high schools. And we're really getting to know our students and our communities and hearing their needs, hearing their obstacles. And that's how this came about. We heard students struggling with considering college, the application process, and we wanted to give more students an opportunity. Sure. Let's talk specifically what you are hearing from those students and from the schools. Um, I, I've done this with both of my kids, college admissions and applications. It's daunting. And then you put in the <laughs> FAFSA on top of that, and there's just a lot of paperwork. And especially if you haven't done this yourself, maybe Correct. you're not a college graduate and you're trying to help your children. So what were you hearing from people about, like, well, I'm not even going to try to do that? Yeah. The myths that I heard from students were, I can't get into Green Bay. I'm not qualified. Why would I even try to apply? I don't think I can afford it, so I'm not going to even try. Um, it's just one more thing I have to do. Like they in high school, high school a seniors lot. have a list, yeah. a checklist of things they want to accomplish, and this is one more thing they have to do. So postponing it, procrastinating, just getting frustrated and giving up when there's too many things to do is what we heard. Sure, sure. A lot of um, kids have to get some of those um, uh, acceptance letters together. They have to get um, things from teachers. Mm -hmm. It's just a lot. There's a, there's a checklist and they go down it. And the schools are great about walking you through it, but it can be daunting. So exactly how will this work for a student in school right now? Well, one of the things we thought about is that the district has a lot of information about the student that we ask on the application already. So what we're going to do is we're going to invite all graduating seniors from the class of 2024 to accept this offer by raising their hand and saying, I'm interested in learning more. And I'm willing to let the district share my information with Green Bay, UW Green Bay. So then we will get data from the high school about the classes they took, their address, their name, you know, all that stuff that you fill out on the application. And you're just repeating data that already exists. So we create a record for them and then we assess their needs. We talk about their dreams and their hopes and their, what they're interested in, what they're nervous about, what they think is standing in front of them actually enrolling in a university, financial aid, talking about how do we make it affordable. What this does is open up, opens up the conversation um, to really understand if Green Bay is the right school for you. And we believe there's students who just don't know and they're not having that conversation because they believe some of those myths. Right. So students um, do have to be ready, as you mentioned. Mm -hmm. They have to be ready for college. They have to be taking yes. classes to prepare them. So how does UWGB, you mentioned career counselors, mm -hmm. how are you getting into the schools to kind of talk about that and say, you know, you should be taking this class? <laughs> <laughs> so I, I think that there's a, a very clear message from the high schools, the school counselors, from the career coaches that are UW Green Bay employees or NWTC employees mm -hmm. that are working inside the high schools right now talking about taking college preparatory courses, getting the most out of your high school education. When it comes down to it, the more you do in high school, the more prepared you are, the quicker you graduate from college, the less time, the less money that you spend, and you get out into the workforce faster. So the more prepared you are by taking courses that are gonna help you be ready for the classroom in college, the faster all those things are gonna go and get you to your dream faster. And it's really nice to see when though you get those college credits in high school by taking some of those courses, it, it makes a difference it in, your, in your financial bottom line. So any student is eligible for this yes. in Green Bay Area Public Schools. But you're looking at a specific type of student or specific things. What, what was this really geared toward? Well, going to back what, to what you said before, when your kids were going to college, there's kids who have um, the means to get the application done, to do all the paperwork. They have the support. They have people who've gone before them, sisters, brothers, aunts, uncles, parents, who help guide them. We think the students who don't have that, the students who need to stay local, they, want, they don't want to live on campus, they don't think they're college material, but they are. They just don't know that yet. 
Those are the students we designed this for, but it, everyone benefits. Mm -hmm. Like we want all students to benefit from Green Bay. If we're the right fit for them, we want students from across this region to choose us. What do you think some of the benefits will be, some of those things? Oh, the benefits long term around this is getting more students into higher education, earning a higher wage, contributing to their community, feeling like we're a part of something bigger. It's economic stability for our region. It's social stability for our region. When students, future workers, yes, really. You, yeah. You're looking at future workers. That's what we want to do mm -hmm. is Grow students who go to Green Bay stay in Green Bay mm -hmm. after they graduate. Mm -hmm. So we want more. And you did a pilot program with this already yeah. to test it out. And it, 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 tell us the results of that. Well, we tested it with 31 students that we already knew really well because they were in some pre-college programs. And we offered them admission without having to apply. And 31 were offered. 21 have already committed to Green Bay for this fall. So we know that removing <laughs> that work. obstacle yeah. makes people go, huh, yeah. Green Bay wants me. I'm qualified. Let me learn more. Yeah. That'll be interesting. So it'll start with the class of 2024. Yes. So next year, those mm -hmm. graduating seniors. Awesome. Thank you, Jen Jones from UWGB, for joining us today and talking us through this unique program. Thank you.